My name is Koki Momota. I'm 29 years old. I'm a freelance illustrator working from home. I handle work-related issues by phone or online meetings, so I spend most of my days inside my room drawing all day. I'm almost finished. Now I just need to do the final retouches and I'll be done for the day. Ko-chan, Dad and Mom have work. They told me to get you. Oh, I didn't realize the time. I'll be right there. Hey, Koki. We'll be leaving for work now. Will you be okay? Thanks for always taking care of Nena. We appreciate it. No problem. I'm here anyway. I enjoy spending time with Nene. So don't worry about me. Nene and I get along well. We're like best friends. I have everything under control. Hey, Kochan. I want to eat dinner at Rina's place. I love her okonomiyaki. Nene, Hoki is tired from working all night. Don't overwork him, okay? <laughs> it's okay. I'd rather eat out than make dinner anyways. Let's go eat okonomiyaki today. Hey, mommy. You have to try Rina's butatama. It's so good. And it's so cute how Ko-chan always watches Rina makes the okonomiyaki. He watches her the whole time. Hey, Nene! That is private information I don't want to be leaked. Oh, gosh. Hmm. Okay, guys, you'll be late for work. Go on, then. I live with my parents, my brother, his wife, and their daughter, Nene. The six of us get along well. Nene's parents have busy jobs. They try to make their schedules work so at least one of them would be at home with Nene. But there are times when both of them have to be at the office. It can't be helped. Nene's father, Toru, and Nene's mother, Manami, both work at a department store. They met through work and got married. I know how busy department stores can be. Their schedules are packed. Both their jobs require them to work at night, and that's where I come in. When both Nene's parents are at work, I'm the only one in the house who can take care of her. Thankfully, my job doesn't have fixed hours. I can work freely as long as I meet my deadline. I have no problem watching over Nene whenever her parents are gone. Kuchan, I'm finished, look. Great, what did you draw? Let's see. Hmm, I wonder what these eight blobs are. Okay, listen. This is Mommy and Daddy. And this is Grandma and Grandpa. Oh, so they're people. She drew our family. And this is Ko-chan, and this is me. Wow! I really like the picture. So what's this and this? It's Rina and her butatama. She drew okonomiyaki. Nene, you really like Rina's okonomiyaki, don't you? All right, I know it's a little early, but you want to head over to her place? Yay! Butatama, butatama, yummy, yummy butatama. What song is that? I made it, the okonomiyaki song. It's become her obsession. Rina, we're here. Hey, Nana, I missed you. Uh, hi there. It's been a while, or not. I'm glad to see you guys again. Find a seat. I'll bring the menu. Oh my, it's you again, huh? I see you here often. Don't you want to feed your kid homemade food? I don't think we're here that often. We only come twice a month. And that child is my niece. <laughs> so your siblings leave their daughter with you. They're probably eating something nice right now. They're such irresponsible parents. I'd like to see what they look like. My brother and his wife work hard to support the family. They aren't just fooling around while I take care of their daughter. It's none of your business anyways. Please stay out of it. This man is a regular customer here. He always comes alone and we bump into him often. For some reason, he likes making derogatory comments about Nene and me. What? Can I get you? I want Butatama. <laughs> you love Butatama, don't you? Yep. Uh, only because you make it, Rina. You're so sweet. Nana, we have custard pudding for dessert. It's today's special. Custard pudding? Ko-chan, I want pudding pudding. Okay, okay. One custard pudding and a modanyaki for me, please. Sure, I'll get right on it. Hey, 
You brought your niece to impress Rita, didn't you? Jeez, how desperate are you? Just ask her out. What? Seeing how you're here this early in the evening, you don't have a job, do you? A jobless loser with a stupid kid? <laughs> I've always known this man has feelings for Rena. Maybe that's why he picks on me. At first, I thought he was just some guy unhappy with his life. I always try to ignore him, but I couldn't take it anymore. I bring my niece here because she likes the okonomiyaki here. I work from home, so I don't have a set schedule for work. What about you? Aren't you supposed to be at work? Plus, I'm not the only one who is desperate. Look at yourself. Ugh. How dare you! Here you go. Hmm? Kamari-san, is something wrong? No, oh, it's nothing. That guy over there was asking me why I was here at such an early hour. He thinks it's weird. <laughs> oh, Kamari-san owns a company, right? Yes, I do! I do! I'm allowed to set up my work schedule because I'm a CEO! Nana, look, I made it into a heart! Wow, a Butatama heart! Look at that, he's glaring at me! It's not my fault she gives you no attention! Thanks for the great meal! Rina, see you soon! I'll look forward to it! Gosh! Rina's okonomiyaki is so much better than what we make at home. It's so fluffy and it fills my heart. I hate seeing that guy, but if that's what it takes to see Rina and eat her okonomiyaki... Mmm, my mouth is watering just from hearing your stories. You guys seem swamped with work. Yeah, we got a lot on our plate. We got this one employee who causes so much trouble. He's the one causing us to stay late. But I think we'll get a day off next week together. Do you guys want to go somewhere? I think Nene will enjoy it. That's a great idea. But after hearing Koki's story, all I could think about is eating okonomiyaki at that Rena girl's place. Okay, fine. We can go eat okonomiyaki then. Yeah, I think Nene will like that too. My brother and his wife's day off. Butatama, butatama. Butarama? She said butatama. I wish father and mother were here with us now. Yeah, but they're always so busy. The whole Momota family only gets together like two days out of the whole year. Rina, look who I brought with me. Hi, sweetie. Aw, you brought your family? I've heard all about your okonomiyaki, Rina-san. Huh? <gasps> Momota-san, the floor manager. Huh? Wait, do you know that guy? Yeah. I know him. Hey, Karami! What are you doing here during work hours? Rabe-san told me you go AWOL all the time and that you're always late for work! So this is what you've been doing while dumping your workload onto the others? Oh, uh... No, this is... I thought I should do some research. You know, to keep up with trends so that I would benefit the... Oh, Kamari-san works at a department store? He told me he owns a company. Owns a company? Oh, so that means he owns a department store? <laughs> oh no, he doesn't! Huh? This man used to work in our sales floor, but he never reported any important incidents to his bosses. We received many complaints about his attitude from the customers. He never treated them with respect. That's why he was moved to work in the back room. However, he hasn't learned from his mistakes. And now he's even started skipping work. Backroom tasks are important too. Karmi, if you keep this up, we're gonna fire you for being so useless. Um, well, I just don't feel like going to work, but I will. I was just in a slump, I'll get over it. You can't fire me. I'll be left with nothing. Cut it out. You brought it on yourself. Come on. Oh, that's your daughter? How adorable! She looks just like you, Momota-san! I remember you telling me how irresponsible her parents were and how you would like to see their faces. Stop it! Mommy, Daddy, this man said I look stupid. No, I didn't! You heard me wrong, little girl! Please don't say things like that! You're gonna get me in trouble! <laughs> I see. So you're saying my daughter is a liar now? 
No! That's not what I meant! So, that means you said my daughter looks stupid, huh? N no way! Wait, did I? Oh no! What am I supposed to say? Hope Chan, what does look stupid mean? Hmm, you don't need to learn that word yet. There are words I don't need to learn? Why do they exist if I don't need to learn them? I wonder why. Karami-san left the Okonomiyaki shop bawling after getting scolded by my brother and his wife. After that, we all decided to stay and enjoy Rina's exquisite Okonomiyaki. Mmm! Mm. It's so fluffy! Karami-san never came back to Rina's Okonomiyaki shop. I was glad. Now I can enjoy the good food without any interruptions. You guys have become regulars here now. Rina, listen! Did you know that Ko-chan is always staring at you when you're making okonomiyaki? Hey! Nene, cut it out! Oh my, really? I hope I don't look ugly. Hey, Rina. Why aren't you married to Ko-chan? I want you to make okonomiyaki for me every day. N nene Shh! Hmm... We can't get married right away. So, what do you think of going on a date with me? Date? What a date! I fell for Rina the moment I met her. And maybe we have mutual feelings. I'm excited to see where this leads to. Adults should watch what they say in front of children. I found it funny how Nena's parents blew up once the issues became about their daughter. Do you think Rina will become the seventh member of the Momota family? I hope she will. Did you guys like today's story? Let me know in the comment section. I hope you come visit me tomorrow. Today's narrator wished you. I'll see you soon. Bye bye. Thank you for watching all the way to the end. Make sure to subscribe and click the bell for notifications.